Hey guys, uh, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to Tapshi Tech and Reviews. So today it's another unboxing video. Uh, we'll be unboxing this package which I ordered from Amazon. So from the title, you might have already come know what it is. So it is a 360 camera from Insta360. So it's called Insta360 X3. Uh, it's a 360 camera. So yeah, without wasting any time, let's get in the video, unbox this and see what we get out of the box. And also let's, you know, uh, try our first 360 video uh, with this. So yeah, hope you'll all like it. Please enjoy. So this is how the package has arrived. So let's open this. So this is Insta360. So the, these are the details which you'll see out of the box can be used for all this purpose for vlogging for cycling surfing even on your you know, bike so the price which they have mentioned here is 51,000 I have paid around uh, 39,000 for this uh, during the great Indian festival so these are the other features so yeah let's open this and this is how it is there's there's something to protect it as well so this is insta 360 camera of course there are two cameras on either side either side will record 180 degree and finally it will be stitched so that's how it works it says insta 360 x3 and They've also mentioned something like invisible selfie stick, 72 megapixel 360 photo, 5.7K 360 capture, 4K single lens mode, waterproof to 10 meters, 360 horizontal lock, AI powered editing. So that's what it says. This is a camera. Let's see what are the other things available out of the box. So there's a cable, it's type C again uh, for charging. And apart from that, there's a pouch to safely carry it anywhere. So they provide this pouch as well. Let's quickly open this. So this is the pouch. So you can put this thing inside this for carrying it anywhere so let's keep it aside and the other things are like so there is a cleaning cloth microfiber i believe and some papers safety guidelines warranty card waterproofing what to know and quick start guide let's ignore that and they also provide a sticker just in case if you need it so yeah that's about what's there out of the box so i don't think so there's anything else inside this so this is a camera so let's turn this on and see how it works so there's a power button there's q button i'm not sure what this is and it's a little heavy let's see what's the weight they have mentioned here they say 150 gram i'm not sure it looks a little heavy yeah it must be 150 gram then let's turn this on and see how it is so there's a led light here there's some initial setup you need to download this app So based on how you hold it, the camera angles will be changed. So yeah. So this is what it looks like on the front. 
So what I'll do is let's quickly charge this, download the app and come back. So I have uh, sufficiently charged this and also I have added the memory card. Memory card goes somewhere here. Need to remove this. I have a habit of you know keeping all the stickers as it is. So need to remove this then let me turn this off first. So I've turned this off. Now we just need to press and you know I need to push these things you know inside and uh, the battery will come out. Once the battery comes out here is where the memory card goes in and then you can just push and you know block the battery compartment. This is where we charge you can charge it over here. There are some speakers over here and these are some buttons there's a power on button and this is a quick menu button so let me turn this on as soon as you on this you need to you know activate this so for that you need to install this app insta360 oh, insta360 this particular app the problem with this app is it's almost uh, 1.2 gb and uh, you can edit the videos as well you can set the frame uh, keyframe and you can edit which side which angle should be shown at particular frame all those things you can do the, do it here so once activated so once activated uh, you can start using the insta360 so this is how it will be and there are some stickers i'll just remove the stickers for now same thing i'll do it here as well so this is how it is there is two buttons over here one is uh, for recording the other one is uh, to change the lens mode you can set it between single lens inner single lens to be something like this you can change the camera as well or if you want the 360 to be uh, enabled you need to press it twice and O360 camera will be activated. So one will be inner single lens. The next one is outer single lens. Basically back camera and front camera you can say. And if you press it again it will uh, be changed to 360 mode. This is where you can you know record the videos in 360 mode. I'll quickly show you all how it works. So let me quickly show you all how the recording works like. So just swipe in if you want to increase the brightness and there are other settings also available like uh, you can use it as webcam and there are other options you can set it accordingly if you can use the external mic as well and apart from that you can connect a bluetooth remote you can connect airpods so there are quick options to turn off the sound vibration mode you can turn off the indicator light and also quick capture on and off you can no, enable it and off uh, turn it off so these are some quick uh, these are some settings and other options available let me quickly show you how to record so let me see so if you are recording something like this it will start recording and you see here it's already recording and uh, stop this and show you how it is going to you know render the video the swipe left and play the video if you swipe you can you know see the whole video how it has been recorded how it has been stitched everything you can see it over here so this is how it is finally how the video is going to uh, how the video is going to get stitched so apart from that you can um, take photos as well i'll try to put some on uh, test videos since later so i just wanted to you know unbox this and um, walk you through the different options available here so apart from that you can set what kind of resolution you want what frame rate you want and the video mode if you want single lens or 360 you can set it over here you want hdr photo you can set that if you want this photo you can select that let me quickly show you all how the photo is going to be 
so it's in photo mode again here there is option 72 megapixel 18 megapixel let me select 72 and take a quick photo so photo is clicked and probably it's stitching the photos from different angles so let's see how this is going to turn out so this is the photo not sure why it's in black and white so figure out later but this is how it is and apart from that you have different options interval it says take photo at specific interval burst mode take nine photos rapidly star labs shoot videos with the star trail effect loop recording record continuously and save only the last fixed length segment bullet time slow motion video with 360 rotation time shift time shift so time shift video can be shot while moving and there are other options active hdr videos also can be recorded time lapse also can be recorded so yeah so this is about it i don't want to increase the length of this video what i'll do is i'll explore more and try to put some demo i'll try to put some test videos sometimes later mm, so as of now this, i just wanted to be a short video unboxing and uh, uh, you know a quick walk through all the menus so yeah let me know what's your thought let's end the video here hope you like so that's it. in the video guys hope you all like the video if you like the video please do the like button subscribe comment let's catch you in next video until then see you